Look at these footprints I just found here. Looks like some kind of wild monkey man ran through here. right there. You can see a back foot right there. Alright. size of this stick. I don't know that foot is. Okay, so it's April 10th, 2020, and for today's name, that species, um, well, uh, well, last night it snowed. It was a rare April um, snow. Okay, so today is April 10th, 2020, and last night we had this really... Uh, rare April snowstorm and uh, as you can kind of see around here everything is covered in snow all through and down in the Floyd's Creek and I figured that that would make it rare and hard to find anything but then I found what I am about to show you and uh, I mean you won't believe it okay so over here there's this uh, this rock wall here and I was walking along it and then I noticed these footprints Okay, look at these footprints right here on this rock wall. You see clear toes right there, and there's a back heel. There's one footprint here, one footprint here, and then like half of the third footprint right here. Um, and the first thing I thought was obviously a Sasquatch. Okay, some kind of Yeti, abominable snowman, big foot. Look at the size of that footprint right there. Um, for comparison, I, uh, I got this stick right here. Uh, I'm wearing muck boots right now, and the stick is similar in size to the muck boot I have on, okay? So you can kind of see that right there. And compared to this possible squatch footprint, it's a good couple of inches longer, okay? I mean, look at this thing right here. This is some kind of crazy, giant footed beast, some kind of giant monkey man swinging through the, the Floyd Field woods here. And he like hopped up onto this rock wall, okay, and ran across. And I don't know where he went. I didn't see anything. I don't see where the footprints go from here. But I mean, this is crazy. And uh, I don't know. I mean, I guess I could get on the rock and compare my foot to the squatch print. Let me see if I can do that real quick without falling here. Okay, so here's the squatch print. Okay, I'm going to make a footprint next to it. You can see, compared to my boot, that Sasquatch print is considerably bigger. It's probably a third of the size bigger than that. I mean, it does not get more crazy than this, right here. So, uh, good luck trying to name this species for today's name that species. Okay, this is. This is just crazy. Let's see if I can 
getting close for a good shot here. There is a cave over there too. Um, let me see if I can go uh, oh, get a shot of that because if there is a giant monkey man swinging around these trees making these prints, that's where he would live. There's Floyd's Creek right over there. I wonder if that's another print right there. Oh, jeez. And then right here and here. Look at that right there. Where is it? Can you get another? Look at that. See another one right there. This is crazy. There's a Sasquatch around here. Oh my god. Where's the cave at? So here's the cave. It's kind of small for a giant ape-like creature. I mean, maybe he's just a little guy and he has giant feet. Ever think about that? This is nuts. I don't see any hair anywhere or anything or any fibers. Could it be a skunk ape? Oh man, a yowie, a yeti, the abominable snowman. I don't really see anything else. Oh jeez. You're out there, Bigfoot. I am... I am friend, not foe. I don't really know what else to look for. I mean, maybe they, like, snap trees and stuff. And... I don't know. I heard they scream a lot. I could... could just... Scream, see if one screams back. I also heard they uh, they like they knock trees. Let's see if I can do that real quick. Like grab a branch and knock it on the tree and make a loud noise. Where's a good branch at? And, uh, here we go. Maybe he'll knock back. Ugh. Ugh. didn't want to break. Okay. Come on, Squatch. Ugh. 
Okay. So they, like, they, they take branches and they knock them on trees. Maybe if he knocks back, we'll know he's out there. This is crazy. I mean, it doesn't get crazier than this. I mean, some kind of giant ape man. He just... Could have came right through here. Okay. Swing on branches. Grab this one right here. Swung up on top of this wall ledge here. Ran across. Hey! Screaming, and then uh, scurried off. Uh, well, that's today's name, that species. I really wish I could get him on tape. Oh, that'd be really cool. If he would just like walk out right now. That trailer over there, that's my neighbor Billy's old house. So unless he's, uh, Maybe he's living in there. That's worth looking out. I mean, they say Sasquatch are pretty smart, so maybe he's maybe he's living in the trailer in Billy's old house. If he is though, maybe I shouldn't bother him. <laughs> he could be in there, <laughs> just <laughs> just hanging out, e eating breakfast. <laughs> oh man, this is crazy. I mean, aside from my boot prints, I don't see anything over here. Is there a squatch in here? Oh, man. Alright, I'm getting a little, uh, a little freaked out over this. I mean, you could, there could be some kind of crazy beast man running around here. Alright, so, um, yeah, that was today's Name That Species, and whatever species this thing is, I want to know. Okay, if I got a, if I got a squash problem, I got to deal with. Today on Name That Species,